hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new my name is vanessa nessa sessa yaya v all of the above depending who you are go ahead and just subscribe to your fan you know if you see more than one video i appreciate you but subscribe before you leave i am going to be showing you guys my shoes collection or my heels collection depending how long the video is i feel like it will be fun i want to do like a total closet clean out as the season is changing and i thought it would be fun for me to show you guys each collection of what i have and as i work through it that way i'm able to see like do i want this do i not want this like i said don't forget to subscribe follow me over on instagram and welcome to the fam <laughs> Here are my shoes. My shoes go from top all the way down to this bottom. So if you missed a couple of my last video, I do have the Kia Pack system, which makes storing my shoes a gazillion time easier. I don't think I'm gonna show you guys sneakers. I don't have, I'll do a sneaker collection video in another video, but for today, I'm only gonna do heels. So let's start from here because I do have a lot of I do have a lot of heels. Let's start from this angle simply because it goes from light to dark. So the very first pair of heels I have are these pair from Nine West. I this was the first pair of heels that I purchased from Nine West, not in this color, in the pink color. Um, I've never purchased heels from Nine West before. It just looked like one of those. I used to think it was like one of those sites that our parents like went to to buy stuff from. I don't know why. These pair I freaking love, and I think I bought I bought three pairs of these from them. So now I have four shoes. So this is just gold on the front, silver bling bling. This feels so comfortable for shoes that doesn't have a strap. On the angle, I'm usually really comfortable wearing these. I have no complaints. Love them. I can wear them all night. And I've worn them a couple of times. So, if you like this style of heels, head over to Nine West and get yourself a few pair. The next pair of heels are these white pairs that I got from Miss Lola. It says Miss Lola right here. The quality of these shoes, I will rate like a six. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking if I should get it lower. I think I would rate these heels a uh, six. They are very cute. They are trendy. Um, they have these this strap right here that's not well made because a lot of the stones fell out pretty fast. I've had this for less than a year. I bought this last year or maybe going on a year. Um, and I have some pair of shoes that just have lasted longer. Miss Lola in general is kind of like trendy type of fashion it is a fast fashion company so a lot of what you pay for which are reasonable price items they don't they're not going to last you forever so it's like one of those things that if you know then you can purchase at your own risk so for that reason i'll rate it that surprisingly a lot of my shoes are from miss lola this pair is from miss lola this pair actually came with a strap from here um yeah there was another strap here that i think went behind the ankle and i cut them off because i wanted this type of style i have two pairs of these in white and black and i cut the strap off both of them um i don't wear these that often because since this strap oops since this strap here is just thin they're not the most like secure um, but I just didn't like the strap in the back of it, so I cut it, but it's cute for whatever I need to wear for. The next pair of shoes are from Miss Lola as well. These are like strapped type of heels that just go up a, around the strap. I'll try and insert pictures of each of these heels if I have them or do like a... You can see it. You've got a pretty good view. These, the heels are around like maybe 4 inches or less, 3.95 or something like that the toe part right here these type of heels like hurt your toe because your toe is kind of sliding down 
um i've also wore this like this strap wrap around my foot this way rather than around my ankle if that makes sense and i do love that look so yeah try that another pair are these square toe these were in style i don't know if they are still in style they're just one of those heels that i wanted to give a try and um i haven't worn it that much i probably wore this heel once um it's okay i think with jeans they're nice i won't purchase something like this again but i keep them because there's those outfits every now and then that they just look good with but i haven't worn it on to one of my favorite pair of heels from miss lola i've talked about this one on my channel it's a simple heel i just think it's like a really cute vacation I just think I just think this is just like a cute vacation type of heel um, or like a casual everyday if you wear heels often type of heel uh, nude I got this in two color this I'll just talk about both at the same time and the brown the brown I've, I've outdone just because it's closer to my shade of nude compared to this one I've just tore this up and I will still continue to wear it it's an easy pair of heel to style so that's why i wear it to the ground next up we're still on the first shelf i'm trying to speed through this the next pair of heel also from miss lola clearly i don't shop anywhere else and i need to are these nude heel they have like these clear strap um i should be rating these right i'll rate this a six a seven i'll rate this a seven the heel and in the bottom of it the base of it is pretty okay the straps are not like the best quality of plastic on here um but they feel nice and secure they're not super tall heel so it's fine if it was really tall then there might be a problem with it so moving on back here the last pair of heel that i have on this shelf is also from miss lola um those tough old type of heels i still really like these heels like when you look at them when you look at them you're like they're kind of futuristic you're not sure what exactly they want to do but i feel them like i i think with pants jeans these type of heels are really cute quality wise i haven't worn it that much but I think it's made really nicely. I think it's like a really good knockoff heel. Up to the next shelf, right here, we have more nudes into pinkish yellow. The first pair of heels are from Zara. I've talked about these on my channel. I actually had this in a size, um, in a black, in a black color, which is up here. It's a two in one and i really liked it i used to wear it everywhere and then i was like okay since i really like it and when i really like something i want more than one color in it i decided to go to zara and pick up another color except this is a size 40 and it was the only one that was left and i had to have it so i bought it in a size 40. i'm a 38. so that's one of the reasons why i don't wear these that often i think with uh long pants they look fine because you can't see the gap in the back but anything else mentally i just can't do it because it looks big next pair of heels these heels are gorgeous i love these heels a lot okay quality i quality wise is miss lola so i probably rate this maybe like a five simply because i've only worn this in my house and it's peeling so that's not good so i'm gonna give this a five cuteness very cute mad uncomfortable i just can't do the five heel thing which is why i stay might stay away from designers simply because i can't i can't imagine paying a lot of money for heels that i cannot wear so for that reason these heels are very cute when i'm doing like a reel or something you know just like throw it on it just looks nice in my outfit but to wear out absolutely the fuck not i think it's because of that arch right here mad uncomfortable can do it some girls can do it me not i these pair of heels are funky just 
They're a little funky. They may not be your style, but they're nice and edgy. Hold on. My 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 iPad wanted to go off and I needed to stay on. Um, they may not be your style, but I just love Babe. I actually don't like these heels. He don't like them, but and I go a lot of places with him, so I don't wear these a lot because I go a lot of places with him. And since he doesn't like it, I mean I can wear it, but I want to look attractive next to him, you know. So I saved these for like girls. Now I've worn it next to him, but I'm just saying the heels are like nice and just what I like. I don't like super tall heels. I don't want to be uncomfortable in my outfit. Like you have to wear your outfit, and confidence is what make an outfit sexy. If I'm wearing a mad uncomfortable shoes that I can't walk, I'm not walking in that room confident. I'm just not. So um, for that reason, I'll stick to my shorter heels, four inches or under, maybe 4.3 max. Zara, just see-through, very edgy, nice with pants also. I don't know if I fuck with this like with dresses, or I don't know if I like these a lot with dresses. Pants, pants type of heel, cute. We already talked about this girl right here, but I've definitely abused her. She's chipping. I'm not mad at it. I'll still wear her though. These heels I've had for quite some time. I purchased this in my early days of Miss Lola. Once again, it is chipping and peeling. I do need to actually, one of my goal that I just came up with is to get rid of some of these cheaper shoes and invest into some nicer heels that are shorter in height. So that definitely will be my goal is to start, you know, investing um, in general. I'm doing that with my closet now. So these are appealing. I've had these for years. They're okay. They're cute. Maybe. let's talk about these last three together okay maybe these two um actually these heels are from miss lola also very cute i love the heels of these because they have those like you know bubbles type of circle thing they go around the ankle the heels aren't super tall they're just not the most comfortable down here kind of hurt a little bit um but it's like a baby pink dusty pink cute moment you know this one is from miss lola i've had this for probably f five years at this point therefore i think it's been holding up pretty well at one point i wore this a lot this is one of those shoes that look really nice with mom jeans i just think they, they look cute not so much like casual dresses or mom jeans these look really nice with that this pair of this is this is one of those pair of heels that I'm so happy I purchased. I bought these heels from Forever 21 on sale for I think eight dollars, and I've had it for six years at this point. I do have to rate these like a solid um, nine. They did well with this heel simply because it's you know it's one of those plastic type of heel. I've worn this so much. Like I said, I've had it for se seven years. The bottom is like lifting at this point. And a truck ran over their shoes. I was filming a couple of years ago. I was filming outside, trying to be cute, different. Um, <laughs> filming outside, left my shoes outside, and a truck was backing up, or a car, a pickup was backing up into the into the, the backyard, and they rolled over my shoes. So the heel is kind of like busted a little bit but i can still get away with it and i still do like i'll still throw this on and, and you know go about my day so for that reason because i've had it for so long i actually will rate this a nine it was 28 dollars originally and i bought it on sale for eight dollars best purchase best affordable purchase of shoes ever i've had great experiences with that pair of shoes and i'm a happy customer let's move up on this shelf should i bring you guys closer Let's finish up with the pink since we ended with the pink. I already talked about these. I have them in the pink. Love this pink. Oh my gosh, this bubblegum pink is so beautiful. So beautiful. Look at it. I mean, look at it. She's adorable. 
I also have this in black, so let me just show this to you now. Just a, I just love, I love pointy toe shoes. I just think they're very elegant. They're chic with your outfit. Um, they make any outfit chic. So I just love those. They're very versatile. I could throw that on with some jeans to make the outfit look a little bit more. Um, those are from Nine West. Once again, I'll rate them like a nine. The only reason I'm not giving it a 10 is because I, I've just got in it. I've worn it quite some time right now and nothing is growing. So that's good. These pair are from Miss Lola. Love the color. They are like the same color as the other one. Except these have like this strap in the front and then this strap up here with a knot. This is very cute. There's a purse um, that matched this that everyone and their mama was wearing. Um, these are uncomfortable. Yeah, these are uncomfortable. Um, for me, at least. I think the heels are slightly taller than what I like my heels to be. So I put like boob, tip, boob tape in the middle to help help it. Not didn't work. But it's cute though. It's cute. These, Miss Lola. Can you tell I'm getting tired? Miss Lola, these chains on here hurt. Okay? They hurt. Um... In comparison to this pair, which I got from Zara, the Zara pair doesn't hurt. Simply because Zara knew what they were doing, okay? They have the band underneath this, the rest on your feet, and then the chains on top. Whereas Miss Lola kind of have the chain wrap on the side of this. So the chain, because the, the shoe goes down like this, this chain is digging in your freaking foot. So, for that reason, I don't wear it too often, but it's a nice pop of color. Like, if you're going to dinner and you're just parking and going inside, it's fine. If you're, but it's not a shoe that I'm going to go walking with. These are from Miss Lola. These are like a really great vacation heels. If you're going to be wearing a lot of orange or you want to pop a color on your vacation, I took this to, to, I took this to Tulum and it was a great idea. Kitty heel, very short, but it doesn't look like one of those really tiny heel. And the middle part doesn't hurt, like, because of the heel, it doesn't hurt. So, yeah, I really like that heel. Quality-wise, it's okay. Nothing crazy. The last pair of pink heels that I have are these um, pink heels from Miss Lola. These are okay. Surprisingly, this right here is uncomfortable, which is why I don't wear it too often. But it's not, it's not super high, therefore... It's manageable. It's just disappointing that it hurts. But once again, these are nice with pants. These type of heels, bulky here, I like to wear them with pants. I don't know why. Let's move on to a green pair, our green shoes. I'm trying to tip up. The first pair in here, Miss Lola. These are, are uncomfortable, but surprisingly, I can walk in these. Not like walk downtown or like browse the street okay like these i can browse the street with these like these i can wear all night type of shoes okay these no nah, no nah. these i can walk from the car to wherever we're going and sit down and then i'm gonna need a couple hours in between get up walk again that type of walk that's what i can do in it the these i can't walk in them i just can't like I can't, I can't walk from a car to a, a, a restaurant. I just can't do it. But these I can do it. And they're cute. And I think maybe it's the strap. It creates a little bit more support at the top. Um, I've worn these quite a lot in a lot of my outfit change videos on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. You'll see them. Um, simply because they're cute to put in videos and stuff like that. But realistically, when you see me wearing those heels in those videos, just know that I, I'm not wearing them like walking no okay let's talk about these so if you watch one of my videos in the past i mentioned these and i thought i was gonna send them back but i didn't um hear me out they're just funky like there's nothing here to support your foot just your one toe your big toe got support the rest of it nah but these heels are so cute look at them nice square you feel me like nice neon green this is like 
if you're putting together an out, it's just, it's just edgy. Hold on. Just edgy, you know, like fun, fun pair of heels, vacation, like a nice short skirt where you can like move your hip. I'm moving my hip, but you can see it. Like these are nice. Throw them on. I haven't worn them much yet, but I intend to. The last pair of heels are these on this show. The last pair of heels are these, and they're a nice green strap heels from Miss Lola. They have like this um, silver thing in the back of them, silver on the strap. It's a very cute moment. Uh, and it is comfortable. The heels are like those clear type of heels. It's like a cute, it, it's cute, it's cute. Um, and the material is like velvet-ish. So like your foot, your feet aren't like sliding out. So it actually, it's a nice grip. Same thing for the strap. It's not gonna be like slipping and sliding and you don't have to like turn the crap out of your foot just to get it to stay in place. It does well, okay? Okay, we already talked about these. We've already talked about these. We've already talked about these because I told, showed you guys the white one and this is just the black version. You know, if you love something, get it in every color budget first um we've already talked about these you know i had a nude pair that is too big from zara okay these trap these trap heels are super cute like this is like classic black vacation heel i'm just mad that it's broken like miss lola this is from miss lola if you can't tell back one, maybe i should stop like as I'm showing you guys these heels, I'm like making a mental note, like maybe I should stop shopping and buying heels at Miss Lola. Like, especially since I've been trying to be really conscious and like buy quality pieces. Um, yeah, because no, no, why? Why is this happening? You pay thirty dollars for shoes. What else do you expect? But for now, I'll maneuver it because the heels are like perfect for vacation. The toe. What I love about this strap heel compared to the first white one or cream one that I showed you, your toe goes here. You have a big toe here, and then the rest of your toe go here. So it's not. This isn't the only support between your toe that's digging in your feet. This is so comfortable. I could wear this for hours. And hours. I just need a better quality heel. This is the only pair of heel that I have here that I thrifted. And I've never worn it. I don't usually normally thrift heel. I don't like thrifting heel. Kind of gross me out. But these pair of heels I thrifted. Um and I haven't worn it out yet. It kind of looks sexy on the feet. It's they're just a sexy elegant pair of heels i haven't worn it out yet but i'm still holding on to it because i feel like i would it was 10 bucks you know last pair of shoes on here this is from forever 21 this is my forever 21 days and um i think i'm gonna get rid of this one every year i tell myself um let's see by the end of the year if i'm gonna wear this i haven't worn that so I think I've just outgrown it. The top shelf has my boots. This is very short, so we're closer to the end. We're almost there, almost there, okay? These are from, where are you from? ASOS? I have no clue. Might be ASOS. ASOS or Zara? Jesus. One of them. I actually can't remember where these are from. I don't know why, but I'm thinking ASOS or Zara. Wide bottom, just leather, cute or pleather. Just very cute, very, very comfortable. Very comfortable, just essential. These, I think I got from Miss Lola. Yes, these I got from Miss Lola. They're like velvet. I love these heels because they have that silver in the front that just adds like a little, you know? just that love it love it i've had it for a few years now it's going strong this is one of those heels that i got from nine west these are so sexy on look at the black in the back 
it's just sexy ponytail sexy just on haven't worn it out yet it's actually comfortable as well very very comfortable i styled these with a few of my outfits but i haven't worn it out it has like a nice velvet patch at the bottom which is nice for grip but really love that and then the last two shoes that are in the back would you guys be mad if i don't show it to you because this top shelf is a glass and i kind of can't reach them uh this one i can reach this is from forever 21 this was back in the forever 21 days but um when i purchased this at the time i actually hated gray i like these because they're just like a simple meal basic if you just want something casual that's it that's gonna wrap up this video i hope you guys have fun watching this video i think the next collection i'm gonna do are gonna be my purses and then my perfume if you guys want to see perfume next let me know which one you want to see first purses or perfume i have a lot of purses a lot of purses <laughs> So, yeah, um, I will catch you guys when I catch you. Stay humble, stay fashionable, subscribe, and follow me over on Instagram. Bye, guys.